Hey everybody, what up? It's Scuff D. Uh, I'm going to do something I normally don't do. Uh, a little crate opening because today, effective two minutes ago, the Iron Warriors are in the game. So it's time. It's time for the Iron Warriors to join the fray. So we're going to do this together. I'm normally not a fan of like, you know, crate opening videos, um, but... You know, I figured it's a little short thing. It's something to do. The Iron Warriors crates are finally in the shop. I've got a bunch of gold saved up. It's a little fun. We can kind of look at these things together. Uh, not really get too deep into it, but, uh, you know, enjoy enjoy the moment together. And hopefully I'll get some good stuff. Oh, there's an Iron Warriors deck. Let's see what we got here. Comes with a one epic. I'm sure a bunch of junk in here and stuff that we're probably going to end up getting anyways. And a nice new little alternate card back. So what is that? And the Warlord is Derek Neric Drager. Survivor 5. Create a random Iron Warriors vehicle in your hand for 2 energy. Interesting. Okay. We'll see how that goes. Um, so I've got 18,000 gold. I've kind of divvied it up in my mind. I'm going to go with... Uh, that gives me 90... 90 legion crates and i'm not going to get them all iron warriors because we got alpha legion coming out at some point but i am going to set my limit for 45 45 legion crates uh for the iron warriors that's it i hope i get some good stuff if i actually get uh, perturabo before that i might stop earlier um just because at that point that's the only legendary currently that i'm not gonna that's not gonna show up in the shop at some given day so here we go let's let's do this Enough talking. Bloodthirst can deal one damage to a friendly infantry or a Stardust unit. Okay. Destroy a vehicle or structure troop or deal four damage to any other unit. Okay. I like that. Junk. Havoc squad. Havoc. Havoc. Yeah. That's a good one. That's a good one. All right. I'll take that. That's nice. Let's do this again. All right. Attrition warfare. It's been teased. Predator structure common deliverers okay. Whoa, Percherabo's wrath. That's two epics. Bitter end. I I didn't read that fast enough. Siege destroyed enemy troop for zero. Okay, cool. Uh huh. Iron circle front line. Eight eight attacks by itself. Okay. Not pricey, but. Again, I'm not I'm not looking at draw three cards when a friendly troop dies, reduce the cost of this card by one. Okay. I like that artwork too, by the way. We're gonna go into more of these. I'll do a card by card later on. Sicker and twenty Flank! Yes. There we go. That's a decent high cost card coming out with flank and a zero ability. That I like. That I like. Good to see. Good to see ya. Alright. Ethan steal plus one on all vehicles and draw a card. Okay. Da, 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 da. Another Percherabo's Wrath. So I've got two of those. We're set. We have the Wrath. Olympian recruits. Your basic starters. Uh, doubled up on that. Viral bombs. That one is could be an all-star. We'll see. We'll see. More recruits. From it in six four front line, okay. Not too shabby. Dominators. Five five when friendly troop dies during your turn, give plus one plus one to troops in your hand. Very nice. Okay. Get out of here, court dog bikes. Rally. Here we go. Rally. Put in a barricade as a rally effect. So for two you're getting that and a front line. That's decent. That's decent. Steel, wreck and ruin, wreck and ruin. Relentless, take damage, take one damage, rage, up it up. Okay, interesting. Not too shabby. The bitter end. Put two barricades in play and draw a card. Okay, so that's what that does. Okay, all right. Price of victory, got another one of those. Volker squad. So far, no legendaries. I'm down 2,000. We've got 7,000 more to go. Oh, oh. I mean, it's extra gems. There is a Warlord. Okay, we've got our first Iron Warriors Warlord. 
Alright, uh, and we already kind of previewed him, so I can build an Iron Warrior's deck without having to sink any money. That's good. Give plus one, plus one to your troops you put in play. Now that's not a rally effect, but it's a decent effect. Rhino. At the end of your turn, draw an Astartes. For a three, okay. Interesting. Interesting. I like that. I still like that. The nine is here to destroy. It's, sure, it's destroy. Doesn't do damage, but it's usable, like right away. That's good to have. That's good to have. Decimation. Destroy a friendly troop. Get plus one, plus one to start using infantry in your hand and deck. Hmm. Okay. Olympia. Put in three Iron Warriors Astartes that cost four or less. So I see a potential spam, uh, troop spam option there. Especially if you're running with these guys that are bringing in a front line, a, bar a barricade. You can fill your board up super fast. Come on, we got 6,000 more to go. We got to get a legendary here somewhere. Come on. Precision Bombardment. Deal three damage. If this target dies, return this card to your deck and draw a card. Okay. Right. Getting some rares. We're getting the rares up here. We've got a couple legendary, right, a couple epics. Yeah, breacher Squad. For one, you can create a Breacher Squad. It's spamming itself as a front line. But for three, that's okay. It might not be bad. Storm Berserk. Rally. Deal four damage to an enemy with front line. Okay. Uh, low health, but significant Breacher damage. Put in play a Bunker. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Crendel Squad. Gain a mark of chaos when a friendly troop attacks and dies. Wow. You actually throw these out here after, like, spamming the board, and you could get these guys up to Demon Princes right away. Uh-huh. I see potential there. Ah, uh, the anticipation is killing me. Another Havoc Squad. Okay, we got two Havocs. We can Havoc the Havoc. We can double up on Havoc. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Okay. Okay. If anything, I'll have some gems to pick up a Legendary, but we're looking for the Legendary, obviously. Another Wrath. That's three. Come on. Two of those. I like having two of those. I like that concept. Give me another Warlord. Here's some options. Yeah, Siege put in play two recruits. I think that's been changed since when they were previewed. For one, being able to put in two troops, that's a better fix. That's not that's not bad. What we got, what we got? Come on. The server's probably like people are just buying crates like crazy. I, I don't know if this will last. If this will last or if it will go down. What's going on here? Don't make me restart the game. <sighs> Give it a couple more seconds, then I might just restart it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Alright, well, we'll restart you. We'll see where we're at here. We're going to close them all. And we're going to go back into Legions. some epics so far we've got four thousand to go four thousand more to blow we've spent half of the nine thousand that I, I set aside and not a single legendary yet it's kind of kind of getting sad deal two damage to a random member troop at the end of your turn eh, okay it's your troop though that's not a unit so they're not as useful if you don't have anything on the table Come on. Now these are gold crates. The good thing is the event wraps up. Um, so if you are in the top three, you've got a guaranteed legendary. Maybe that will include Iron Warrior stuff. We're doing this again here. Come on. Mm. Mm. 
it's breaking the, the internet. Alright, well, I'm really getting up. This happens a third time, I might just have to hold off, hold off the rest of my, my explosions. Uh, not bad though, I've gotten, what, four epics? Maybe five epics? A bunch of rares, obviously, you get a rare in each of those, I think. I think in each of those, you're guaranteed a rare, so there is that. The rare game is strong. But it's the legendary game that matters, man. Viral bombs. Second viral bombs, good to have. I don't know if you're going to need two in a deck, but, uh, you know, you might. Mm, the second Warlord guy doubled up. Okay, well, at least we've got the option to play Iron Warriors out the gate, so that is nice. See, bring in those guys. <sighs> the energy. Come on. Tons of Olympian recruits. We're past that. We're past getting doubles of these rares. That's not what we want. That's not what we came here for. I think Perturabo's Wrath is going to be like the Storm. It's, it's. I mean, not that it's a bad card, but I, I get that more than anything for the Iron, Iron Hands. So I might just end up get. That's the fourth one I've had. I'd like to get something else, please. Okay. That's five. Come on. Come on. You know there's more than two epics in this game. Superior. Here's a new one. Destroy a troop with three or less attack. So that could be their destroy a troop card. Hmm. Okay. With three or less, I mean, that, that, that hits a lot of stuff. Ah, oh, boy. I don't have a lot to say, though. My, 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 my goal is kicking down. I've got 2,000 left to go. See, and I wasn't sure. It's like, ah, do you go in early or do you go in late? Because if you go in early and the drop rates are off, they could either be off negative or they could be off positive. Maybe... Maybe, but you think 45 crates? 45 crates, you should have a, one legendary, right? Right? There we go. Here's a second Warlord. So put in, play a barricade. All right. Forex. I might be doing a Forex deck. I, I might be going with the spam route there. Might just do it. I won't have to buy him in the shop. I've got plenty of gems here to pick up. The and we're gonna have to take a look here uh, at the legendaries to see all the things I didn't get. Um, you know, I've got plenty of time to pick these up. Obviously, this is just day one. We're gonna have an event starting here. All right, one thousand to go. We've got uh, five. We've got nine more crates counting after this. Is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna cap it at nine. I don't know if that's over or at the 45, but uh, here we go. This is one. <sighs> that's not what I wanted, but I'll take the extra gems. And this is two. Okay, we're starting to see doubles of, of other things that aren't Perturabo's Wrath, so I'll take it. This is three. This is four. Another epic. Okay, so that's two of these guys. And that has potential with the Forex deck. I like it. I like having those. This is five. Now see, that seems to be going down at a higher rate here. 96. I should be at 94 when I'm done. Okay. 
okay. That's six. Maybe I went seven. Maybe I miscounted. I must have miscounted. So we'll go with we'll go with two more. I'm overshooting it a little, but you know, I'm gonna make up some gold in the events coming up here and and uh, the reward crates. So that's okay. So we'll do this and then one more. <sighs> Striking out on legendaries, folks. But that happens. That's the game. It gives us something to aspire to. I got gems. I got gems, and I can play an Iron Warriors deck. That's three Havocs. So I'll take it. I'll take these results. They're not bad. They're not fantastic. Really would have liked to have Perturabo out the gate, but uh, looks like I'm going to be sitting out on this one for a bit. I'll be playing with Forex for a while and, and kind of trying something new. So um, let's take a look really quick. I'm, I'm, I, I took time out of my lunch today to sit in a parking lot so nobody could bother me at work. Let's just take a look and see what I didn't get. I didn't get Perturabo. Uh-huh. I didn't get uh, Logos. Your Warlord heals four and gains plus one O to vehicles you put in play. That's a nice upgrade. That's a good heal, too, and you could use two of those. Oh, wow. I would have liked to have that. So that's two cards I don't have. 30th Heavy Squad. Deal one, two damage to random image with a desert. Very nice. Would have liked to have that. That's three. Alice Scaramanca. Take control of an enemy vehicle. Vehicles beware. Vehicles beware, folks. Contrador, which has been uh, previewed. So that's four, uh, five. Ancient Herend. Is six destroying enemy troop with front line as a rally? That's a solid rally for a six. Uh, Forge Breaker is seven plus two to your warlord. Erasmus Golg is rallying relentless, give plus two plus oh, and deal one damage to your other troops. Hmm, that's not bad. It's not great, but that's not bad. Uh, so it looks like nine or ten of these I didn't get, just the epics and the legendaries. Pertrop is plus minus one cost when a friendly Iron Warrior's troop dies during your turn. It's 15. Looks like they might have learned a little bit from uh, from from Ferris Manus. They've reduced this cost, so technically you only have to kill five Iron Warriors. That's not terrible. That's easy enough to do, I'm sure, with a Purdy deck. Um, all right, well, that's it. Thanks for joining me. I'm going to be uh, looking at Forex. I'm going to be figuring out some stuff. We're all going to have fun with the Iron Warriors here, at least for the next week or two, and test them out and see how they go. Uh, looking forward to the event wrapping up here in 15 hours. I might have myself a guaranteed legendary coming. Maybe, just maybe, that guaranteed legendary will be what I'm looking for, but we'll see. Uh, we'll talk about the practice mode here a little bit later, and I've still got a card by card to do for the Raven Guard, but that's it for me. Everybody, thanks for watching along. Good luck in your polls. I hope you get stuff. Um, I'll be jealous if you get more than one legendary out of 45 crates. But it's that's the nature of the game. All right. Play more legions or keep playing legions. Keep playing legions. Get ready, man. This is just one of, of, of three coming. So get ready. And we'll talk to you next time. All right. Bye.